Hi guys, in this video I will show you how to make this easy saber effect in After Effects. First of all let's go to tracker and hit track camera. Once the analyzing is done, select some points on the car and click on set ground plane and origin. Right click again and select create null and camera. Create new solid layer now. Let's rename it to lines and make sure to make solid size bigger than the composition. I will set the size to 2500. Once we have that large solid layer, make sure to move it above track null and then toggle it off for a while. Grab a pen tool now and draw a mask something like this. Once you're satisfied with the mask, link line solid layer to a track null and then enable 3D on it. If your mask will become that small, press S on your keyboard and scale it until you will be happy. Then press P on your keyboard and reposition the mask. Once you are satisfied with it, toggle on lines layer and add Saber plugin on it. Expand customize core and change core type to layer masks. Then expand render settings and change composite settings to transparent. Let's toggle off masks from here to see the Saber better. You can now choose any preset from here that you will like, I will choose default, cause I find it cool to me. Now change start size to 0 and make sure start offset is set to 0 as well. Then change end offset to 35 to make the saber line shorter. We can now animate it and we are almost done. Make sure you are at the beginning of lines layer and then click on mask evolution stopwatch icon. Scroll to the end now and change evolution to 1. Let's check it. Already looks cool but, let's adjust the saber line a bit. Decrease end size a bit and then increase end roundness. Now I want the saber line to go underneath the car like in the intro, that will look better. Duplicate your video. Move it above lines and delete 3D camera tracker on it. Grab a roto brush tool now, then go to very beginning of duplicated layer and double click on it. Roto brush the car as smooth as possible. Once you are done, click on freeze button. As the freezing is done, go back to composition. If you play back the video you will see the line is underneath the car but, I don't want it to be under it in the front of the car as well. So, what we are going to do now is, pre-compose roto brush layer, rename it to whatever you want and make sure move all attributes is selected then hit OK. Now grab a pen tool and let's mask the front of the car. Press M on your keyboard and change mask mode to subtract. Let's fix this weird line here. Press F on your keyboard and add feather to smooth the edges of your mask. Also you can make your mask a bit more bigger and everything will look better. Let's quickly check it. That looks way better. Select lines layer and you can adjust the mask, for example if you don't like the path, feel free to change it as you'll enjoy more. Also you can add more lines and change colors of the saber. Simply duplicate your lines layer and press S on your keyboard, scale that one a bit. Press P and change position as well. Once it's cool, feel free to change saber color. Hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and like the video please.